And here we go, the referee's leading the players out onto the pitch as we speak. And there we go, that's kick off. Brighton City start with the ball and passing right back to their area through the middle of the right hand side. Carl Haylock's through, but it looks like Harvey Sayers going to get the first. Is he going to pump the ball in? Lovely pump in, but straight into the keeper's hands there. Right there. Reed's got the ball. Sayers in, Sayers in, Sayers in. Oh, just hit the net in. A lovely one there for Harvey Sayers. He's told just to mob these players to uh, push up. He's got another couple of building, another attack. Here we go. Barrel full pumped up. Brighton team managed to get the first touch. Back to Lewis Top. Oh, it's fell. It's fell lovely for the number 11. He's putting it in. It's a goal! What a goal! 1 0. Lewis Top tell. I think it was Jake Reed scored the, scored the goal. A beautiful ball in. So he just elted it down the left. The left hand side near the corner flag pushed it. Lowest off trying to dominate possession. Here we go again. I would say on the right hand side, he's pumping it in. Hibson, lowest off on the attack. Then I would say uh, coming down the right hand side now. Just passing back to uh, Hinton. Hinton passing the ball back in. Say it's going to get it in. Oh, it's gone. It's rocketed into the uh, player's car park. And. Oh, lovely corner in. Lowest stuff still with the ball. He's. Gibson just smashed it. No Val passed it down again. Looks like Josh Hayes is there now. Lowestoff still managed to keep the ball right and see desperately um, defending. Ball crossed to the right hand side. Lowestoff to go for attack again. Reed's there. Ball crossed in. Still kept alive. Right, you see our player in now, and they're travelling down the right side. Oh, a lovely side tackle there by Lowestoft. Full bit contested in Bright and C's box. Bright and C, every time Bright and C pump it out, Lowestoft just pump it straight back in. So, very much Lowestoft on the attack at the moment. Lovely ball there. Bright and C managed to clear to the halfway line. And then now, Paige, it's uh, Lowestoft Town 1, Bright and C region 0. We must be not too far from approaching the last time soon. Hang on, Carl Haylock's got the ball. Carl Haylock's got the ball. Can he get the little one off? Regent are defending there for their lives. It's gone out to Sayer. Ball pumped in. Regent deflected. Pulls for a handball. The referee's given a hand the ball. It's gone over to the right hand side. Low stop now on the attack. Lovely ball in. Reed's got the ball right on the edge of Regent's area. That's gone out to Hipperson. Hipperson's got the ball. He's offloaded it just wide of the uh, Regents goal there. This could be a lot of chance to make it 2-0 just before the break. Comes in. Headed away and the referee is blown for half time. It's half time here then. At the Crown Meadow Foster Sisters Community uh, Stadium. Okay. And the referee blows the whistle. We, the second half is underway. Lowestoff's charging straight away. At Regent. Almost a rapid uh, fire start there. I it was so good, I couldn't keep the camera up for uh, speed. Lovely cross in. No one there to receive it though, and uh, it's a goal kick for what is reading. It's a great atmosphere here. Oh, headed but just the wrong way. Lowestoff still have it though, it's in the box. Can they make something of it? 
Lois Doss still have it in the Regent's box, still have it, bumped it but defended. Pumped it, Regent can't clear. And again, Lois Doss have the ball. It comes to Lois Doss, number 10. He's gonna, can he whip it in? He's whipped it in, he's just gone over though and out for a goal kick. And just passes back, playing a lovely triangle there. The uh, ball comes down into the right side. Harvey Sayer trying to get in on it. Harvey Sayer and the keeper now, but the keeper just has it first. And it's gone down the other end to... For credit to Brighton City, they've not made it easy for Lowestoff. They've defended well at times, they've you know, closed the doors. Lowestoff will do the same. We've got to give credit, Brighton City have had an attack, uh, quite a few dangerous attacks, but Lowestoff on the edge of the box again. It's coming in. That was classic, uh, strong defending there from Brighton City. The ball's under oh! It's on the edge of the box, it's not a penalty, but Lowestoff player was taken out. It's a yellow card for the Brighton City player. Two yellow cards brandished there. I'm not sure what just happened, but the last off player was, uh, I can't see who it is right now, he's down the floor, taken out on the edge of the box in between the uh, Brighton City goal and the corner flag over the shed end. Obviously, the lowest off fans had a really good view of that, so especially those at the clubhouse, but on the stats, he's got a yellow and a red. So I'm assuming it's a second yellow rather than a straight red. I can't give you any more insight on that, but can I get up in 10? Sorry, I'm probably saying the name's wrong. Forgive me. Apenten, has been sent off. And, oh, Lowestoff had a wicked shot from outside the box, but Keeper just managed to get a hand to it. Lowestoff still in possession, but it's gone. They tried to pump the ball into Lowestoff's box, but Lowestoff won it, and straight away we're back on the attack again. It looks like it's gone to Jake Reed. Reed's running down the left wing. He's running towards the box. We've got blue players in everywhere. He's taking a shot, but uh, straight to the... So let's just keep an eye on that. Right now, though, Lowestoff Town working down the right-hand side. Harvey Sayer, his best bet is today. Pushing into the middle now. It's looking good. A long ball in, but the goalkeeper on target. Oh, and great tackle. Lowestoff on the attack now. They can, this has been scored from this before. Regent desperately getting back. Reed's through. Reed has broken through. Lowestoff playing it around. Just the box. Lowestoff are hitting just from outside the box and it's 2-0! Lowestoff turn 2! Brighton City region, 0! We'll be 15 minutes then to get any chance of getting back into this game. Player on actually, but again it's three put Lowestoff players straight there to uh, cut off any dangerous attack. Regent now though coming in, this could be dangerous, Derek Samoa. He's gone back out the box. It's gone through and they've scored. Regent have scored just inside the box. Derek, good goal there. Uh, Derek Slow just laid it off. Lowestoff didn't get the first touch. The guy chanced it. He, you know, one hitted it. If you're not already subscribed, please subs press the subscribe button, hit the subscribe button, and uh, press the notification bell. Lowestoff pumping it in. Oh, it's going to be dangerous. But it's just gone behind. Shed Lowestoff now on a run. Lowest, well, it looked like the lowest off was fouled. It looked like the ref gave an advantage, and lowest off through, but then the ref brought it back for the free kick. So I'm not sure why, but there we go. the end of the game then the referee has blown the final whistle and Lowestoft have beaten Brighton Sea Region here at the Crown Meadow two goals to one